first started off cooking when I was 14 um, as an apprentice at Tai Cafe Cucina in the South Yarra and then uh, from there on we, um, we went over to Bakaro and from there on I went overseas for five years, worked in Italy and France in, uh, in some of the top restaurants and then come back here and uh, lo and behold we bought a restaurant and away we went. So you part owners here in yeah. Sardis. Yeah. How long have you been going now? Four years. Four. Congratulations. And Kate, congratulations on your recent achievements as well. Now what's the dish today, Chef? Uh, one of the dishes we have on our menu, which is a, a pretty good seller, is the uh, braised, slow braised wool cheeks, milk fed veal. And we serve it with a um, Roman cauliflower okay, that's been roasted with pine nuts, uh, organic sultana, uh, dehydrated and crispy black rice and a prosciutto consomme. Sounds wonderful. Okay. Sounds wonderful. So what we've done here to, to the mill is we've braised it very slowly in red wine for about eight hours and then we, we for service we uh, cry back with some of the juice and we plunge it in boiling water or 80 degree water uh, for about eight minutes and then we strain it and then once we collect the majority of the straining li liquid, we make the, the jus out of that. Sounds there. wonderful. Okay, no, that's all just to get the meat, so give it a nice gloss. Yep. Okay, and a bit of acidity to the to the dish. Wonderful. So in the meantime, what we can do is get a regular salad for the, for the dish, which is the couscous, the sultanas, the pine nuts, Olive oil, sea salt, some cracked black pepper, and we just mix that gently. So the cauliflower beforehand has been cut up and then just toast, toasted in a hot pan with a little bit of olive oil. Yep. Okay. And explain the rice, Chef. The rice? The rice is um, a Venetian black rice okay, that we get imported from Italy. Um, it's cooked out with milk. Okay. With milk? Yeah, because it has no starch. Okay. Okay, then we wash wash it, and then it's uh, dried in a dehydrator overnight, and then we, we fry it in a deep fry, we get sort of crispy black, sort of uh, very, uh, very earthy rice. Wonderful. Okay, it stays sort of crispy once the consomme is in there, so you get a little bit of a crunch yeah. through the whole dish. So what we do is we uh, spoon it with a push push. Okay. We get our rice. stage we put our little stock on or jus. Once that's done, we'll just do that. Like so. 
And then we finish the dish. Some of the parsley. Wonderful dish, Chef. Thank you.